Well, hi folks, and welcome to your ultra detailed walkthrough tour for number 27 Ferguson Circuit here in Ngunnawal. Uh, just in behind me, the street that we're in is a really quiet loop street. So if privacy and tranquility is important, you're going to love this property. So we're set well off the road with this long driveway. We want to start the tour and show you just how much space there is for additional vehicles. You might have lots of friends and family that want to come and visit. Luckily, you can accommodate all of them. I also just love down the side here, a paved area where you've got space behind those gates for say a boat or a caravan or a trailer away from all of this area and of course our double garage is going to give you that uh, remote control entry and also internal access to the home. Okay let's get into the property and see what we've got inside for you. We've got here a completely freestanding and single level four bedroom on suite home with double garage. So we come into the entry here I'm going to take you through these bifold doors and pop you straight into our main living space. So this is our combined living and dining area. There's a lot to show you here. For a start straight away, you'll see these full length windows and doors, and that's characteristic right throughout this property. Let lots of natural light in. And uh, you've got brand new roller blinds on these uh, windows. You've got a new ceiling flan, and new lighting right throughout the property as well. The owners have also fully repainted, and you've got brand new Timberlook laminate flooring as well. So really, the house has been completely modernised. We're going to take you out to this paved and covered entertaining area where the owners have put a brand new pergola cover on here for you. So all of that's just been done. Um, this pergola is a lovely outdoor, one of two outdoor entertaining spaces and large enough where you can fit quite a large outdoor setting, again, for all those awesome barbecues and family get-togethers. Out here, you've also got a clothesline, uh, external tap, and that's a, another side entry up from the garage. We'll have a look at a little bit later. You've also got these raised uh, uh, retaining walls and garden beds and all of this is so beautifully looked after for you. A little patch of grass down there to the golf course which I'm going to show you very shortly. But let's come back inside the house now so I can show you the rest of the living spaces. In through the sliding door and we turn left now. And so this is our dining area, meals area opening off the kitchen. Um, so again, these full length windows are characterized by this um, and we come through and out a sliding door to an fresco entertaining area that's uh, um, uh, just uh, under 20 square meters in total. So under the roof line, this area is such a wonderful space spot to come and enjoy this aspect and outlook that this property's got. Let's come right down and show you this. So what we're backing on to here is one of the fairways of the Gungalan Lakes Golf Course. And when you're talking about scarcity in real estate, finding a property backing onto a golf course, well that is pretty difficult to find. There's only a certain number available and uh, only a certain number that ever come up. So this again is your outlook as you wake up and go to sleep every day. Okay, back inside the house there's still so much more to show you. I'm going to come in and go left. I want to show you through the kitchen um, just to illustrate just how much work the owner's done here for you as well. So have a look at that oven uh, and separate cooktop, Westinghouse stainless steel appliances, all brand new. A brand new cooktop that's a five burner gas cooktop with a range hood over. Again, brand new appliances and heaps of covered storage. And even as you're washing up at the sink and putting uh, things away in the dishwasher, your Bosch stainless steel dishwasher, Again, you get to appreciate that outlook. Have a look at all the rest of the bench space, cupboard, storage drawers, um, your fridge area, and again, heaps and heaps of additional storage and adjustable melamine shelf in here for you. So if storage is important to you, you're going to love this house because the kitchen storage is only the start. Let's come in and have a look at the main bedroom. So you actually go through a sliding cavity door which can shut these living areas off from the bedroom wing and all the bedrooms are gonna go down the side of the house which we'll look at shortly. So it starts with the main bedroom and you're gonna notice a few things. First of all, of course, let's go and have a look at that view again. We saw it before and you're able to wake up to this and go to sleep every morning and with the main bedroom positioned right at the back beautifully. In terms of storage, you're not gonna believe how much you've got. You've got four doors of uh, storage space here in the robe and this is only one of the areas or one of the robes. Uh, let's come through into this area where you've now got a walk-through robe and another four door storage space both here and here. You can't 
ever have enough storage, can you? And then that takes you through into the ensuite. You can see our ensuite's been uh, updated as well. So we've got a separate toilet and shower uh, and a vanity. We've updated tap room and everything. And again, that's all tucked away behind the sliding cavity door. Okay, come with me. You might have also noticed that the bedrooms then have got brand new carpets throughout them. Um, storage, just as we go past this one, another storage cupboard. I know I keep talking about storage, it's because there's so much. And again, even down the hallway, you're going to find another four doors. Come past and have a look at that. And here, okay, check it all out. All right, we're gonna keep going, go left, and we're gonna take into the main uh, bathroom here. So the main bathroom, again, has had a little uh, upgrades to tap rear and whatnot, but you've got your separate bath, uh, quite a large vanity with storage area, external uh, window for ventilation and a corner shower. And as we come straight around that, that toilet room is separate again. That's a new toilet cistern and seat. Um, so I think it's quite nice having that toilet separate. Okay, down the hallway, uh, just a little bit longer, we go left and we encounter bedroom number two. Now bedroom one was huge and this is not quite as big, but gosh, it's not far off it. So this would actually accommodate a queen very easily uh, if not a king. More storage, all the bedrooms, by the way, have storage built in, so you've got two door row here. And that looks out through another full length window to where you see that trailer. Um, where the video started, there was that room for the boat caravan or trailer. Left we go here, and again, we're still appreciating there's new carpets throughout the bedrooms, those new roller blinds throughout the property. Those full length windows now look into that stencil concrete driveway. And then we get another two door built in robe space here with bedroom number three. And then straight across the hall, let's go uh, right now and we'll show you the fourth bedroom. This is the smallest of them all, but very comfortably able to accommodate the single bed, a little study desk if need be, and again, that all important storage, so there's a two door storage robe there. And this room looks out through those windows through to that driveway area. Okay, let's keep going. We're gonna come back through the living spaces. And I wanna show you the size of this laundry. So go ahead of me there and you're going to see a massive laundry. Um, it's got an external door, which cause your clotheslines just out there. If you spin around, you'll see your corner tub. Internal access, of course, more storage space here. And it also doubles as a bit of a mud room because you can come straight in from the garage. The kids can take off their shoes and coats and whatnot uh, before they dirty up your lovely house. Into the garage, it is pretty important to note just the size of it. It's over 65 square meters of total space. And that makes it substantially bigger than a normal 36 square meter garage. So it's really the size of three garages. You've got your NBN connection is right in the corner. And if we come around the back here, we'll walk you right the way through to orientate you, uh, show you just how much space you'd be able to have. Let's say you've got a, a workbench and, uh, and whatnot. Let's say you've got kids' bikes. Let's say you've got uh, kayaks. All of that can be accommodated. And then back out to this paved area where we showed you halfway through the video. Guys, that's the tour. We've taken you right the way through it. It's a single level home, which is vacant and staged, and that means it's available for immediate occupation. But we're also happy to uh, be flexible with settlement options should you have another property you might want to sell. And that's again, just end the video by reflecting on the outlook that we've got here, the tranquility, and uh, the odd golf ball's gonna go by, but I tell you what, what an amazing spot. We hope you love the property. I hope you watch this video a couple of times so you can appreciate everything there is to offer and otherwise we'll see you at the next open home.